So yesterday, the Saints beat the Broncos 31-3. to As we all know, the Broncos were without all of their quarterbacks. They were forced to play with a practice squad player as the starting quarterback. The player's name was Kendall Hinton, who only went one for nine and threw two interceptions, uh, Gabe. So the big question is, for the Broncos in the NFL, uh, should the two teams have even played yesterday? I do think that they should have played. I mean, to start off, um, the NFL did say that if anything happens due to COVID with any of their, in, like, it's basically like an injury. So they said if any of those positions, they're all gone, they will still have to play. So I do think that is the case, and they definitely should have played. Yeah, and Ansley, the, what, what do you think this tells us about the league what, that they made the two teams play? I mean, Gay makes a good point that, you know, the NFL did say that they were treating COVID as an injury. What are your thoughts on the game? Yeah, I think Gabe hits it on the head. I think um, the NFL needs to kind of stick to its guns a little bit. And they have to be that governing body. Like whenever you take that governing body role, you really have to be that governing body and kind of stick to your guns when you create these protocols and these memos that were released preseason. It's the same as if, you know, the Chiefs were without, you know, they were without Patrick Mahomes. What happens then? If, if he tests for positive for COVID, do they get to postpone their game because their star quarterback's out? I think you have to – there's a lot of double standards involved with it. So, uh, I think the NFL – we're learning a lot about the NFL and just saying that they take, they're take they taking these protocols really seriously and they're sticking to their guns. Yeah, it definitely seems that way. And, guys, it seems like, you know, a lot of teams have been hit with COVID, but it seems like Denver Broncos have been hit, hit the worst. Uh, it seems like they're setting the precedent pretty good, uh, what they said. Uh, beginning of the season. So that was our thoughts on the uh, Denver Broncos and the Saints. I'm Dylan Denmark along with Gabriel and Andrew.